What's going on everybody? Today I'll be reviewing the Ring the Cage uh, Japanese style uh, C17 hook and loop training gloves. These are a new release uh, by Ring the Cage. Um, they make a lot of different style boxing, sparring, Muay Thai gloves. Um, these were made to be a kind of a replica of the winnings boxing gloves. Uh, winning style, if you're familiar with those, I'm sure you are. Um, and they're a really damn good replica, man. I tell you what, um, they're, they're, they're very comfortable. They're top notch in quality. Um, I'll go over the quality first and then we'll go over a little bit about the performance of the glove and the similarities between this and the winnings glove because uh, there are some subtle differences. So uh, first off, um, the quality of the glove is, is definitely top notch. Uh, as you can see, it's 100% you know, top grade leather. Um, the, the, the actual cut on the leather is real nice and thick. Um, all of the stitching is done perfectly. No loose threads, double stitched around the thumb. You have the, the attached thumb right there. The leather quality is great all around. It's not like some gloves where they use a different quality of leather like on the palm, but then the, the knuckle area is a different quality. None of that. Everything on this glove is, is the same. Um, so it has that and it has the hook and loop strap. Um, this glove comes in uh, 16 ounce. I know they're going to be making these in 12 and 14 as well. Um, and they're also going to have, a, a, they also have a lace-up version too. So it's not just a hook and loop, but they also have lace-ups. Um, so you can see, very similar, they use a, there's a solid color scheme like Winnie's does with the, the white trimming around the, uh, you know, the inside and then around the thumb. Um, <clears throat> the inside uses a, a kind of a similar to Winnie's, a nylon lining. Uh, <clears throat> it has a grip bar right here with the weight printed on there, 16 ounces. Uh, the profile is very similar to Winnings as well, where it has kind of a, a straight cut down here that kind of tapers up around, as you can see from that view, from the side, from this view, from the top. Uh, and then obviously has a Ring of Cage logo right there, which I like. I mean, it's, you know, some of the Ring of Cage stuff is very gaudy. It has, you know, stuff written all over it. It's really kind of loud. I like how it's just simple, just the name on there, and then obviously the name on the wrist, on the strap. Um, the big difference, I would say, between these and an authentic winnings gloves, other than the way it looks, is the width. Uh, if you were to put winnings right next to these gloves, they're, li they're quite a bit, I mean, I wouldn't say a ton, but a good amount more narrow. Uh, so with these gloves, because they're wider, um, there's a little bit more space in there, even with your hand wraps on, uh, for your hand to kind of move around a little bit. And because of that, um, the top of the glove also, the uh, padding is, is wider and flatter. So it's not as rounded off. So uh, when you're making a fist on the inside, it almost you can almost feel the padding kind of just more lay on top rather than wrap around your hand. Um, unless you have really you know big hands, then that probably won't be a problem. But if you, I'm five eight, about one forty, so uh, my hands you know around my wrist area is not as big, so I can definitely feel a little bit of uh, room inside there because of that. But overall, man, a ten out of ten for quality, man. These are made in Pakistan. Um, where a lot of custom Mexican style gloves are made um, and I mean they're 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 awesome uh, I can't say anything bad about these gloves construction wise uh, so as far as comfort goes they're ex extremely comfortable once you put your hand in and you lock your hand in there um, it feels broken in already um, it's not an IMF padding system it's just a, like a layered foam kind of like what uh, Winnings uses with a I think a denser foam and a, and a less denser foam for, for protection um, so they're broken in already, you don't have any problems opening your hand up and, and making a good fist and making contact with the knuckles. Uh, so that's great. It's not IMF like I said earlier, so you don't feel any stiffness in here when you hit the bag. It makes a nice pop. Uh, thumb placement is good, it doesn't, it doesn't feel awkward. Um, this part right here is, is pretty good as well. It doesn't pinch down on your thumb either. I notice that some gloves are a little bit more narrow. Uh, this part on the glove will, will pinch down on your thumb, it will be kind of uncomfortable after a while. Uh, that's not the case with these, so that's that's good as well. Um, Performance-wise, uh, these gloves do an excellent job protecting both your wrist and your knuckles. Um, you know, the one thing about winnings that people always love about them is uh, their protection. You know, um, they're not gigantic pi pillows like the Everlast uh, Protex gloves are, but they offer a similar amount of protection. You can really lay into the bag and and hit the bag and not worry about um, your knuckles getting sore or your wrist getting all banged up. So. Uh, the wrist protection is pretty good. Um, the laces obviously will be better than the hook and loop in my opinion. Lace-ups are always better because you can get that real nice snug fit. Uh, but the knuckles are good, man. Um, it feels great. It makes a nice pop when you hit the bag with these. 
Um, and I think they're only like $90 from Ring the Cave or $99. So about $100 plus or minus, you know, depending on where you live to have them shipped to your place. So um, for a, you know, a glove of this caliber, that's a smoking deal, man. $100 for, for a top quality glove like this is a really good deal. So it performs well. It looks great, smells great, uh, you know, has that nice leather smell when you pop it out of the box. You can really tell that it's a nice quality leather glove. I was actually really surprised when I got these. I didn't expect them to be as nice as they were, but it's better to be surprised in a good way than in a bad way, right? So definitely a great glove. Highly recommended. Uh, Ring the Cage, um, they also have great customer service, so it was nice ordering these from them. Um, if you guys have any questions, hit me up. Let me know.